when Android 6.0 Marshmallow was released, Google introduced a feature called Doze to increase battery life. Now while Doze has done a lot for battery life, it's also become a pain point for some people. Android will detect when you're not using your device and then that's when it will enable Doze. But when it does that, it puts your device into a deeper sleep. This means some applications that used to run in the background w might not run properly. More often than not, this can lead to missed notifications for certain apps. But thankfully, there's a way to disable Doze on the Galaxy S7 and S7 Edge for certain applications. To do this, we need to launch the Settings app. Then we're going to scroll down and tap on the Battery option. And then if you look at the top right, you'll see a More button. Tap on that and then tap on the Optimize Battery Usage option. By default, we're going to see this Apps Not Optimized option selected. And this is what this shows you all of the applications that are ignoring Doze. You can tell I'm using the Verizon Galaxy S7. So they've made it for things like Verizon Login, My Verizon Mobile will ignore Doze so it can always run in the background. Sadly, we can't change any of these, but what we can do is switch to the All Apps option. Now this will give us all the applications and services we have installed on the Galaxy S7 and S7 Edge. So for example, say we have missed notifications from Gmail because of those. All we have to do is come in here and toggle this option off for Gmail. If you wanted to, you could do this for every single application here and it will essentially disable Doze on the whole device, at least as far as individual applications are concerned. As I mentioned, you're going to see both apps and services listed here. So even though you don't have application icons for game service and gamepad service, that's just because it's a service installed and not a specific application. So once you go through this whole list and disable those for the applications that you want disabled, all you have to do is press the home button and then go about your day. This setting will stick after a reboot and you won't have to mess with that again. But as always, you can go back into settings back into battery, back into this section, and configure any more of these applications. So if you do this for like a game, you're going to let that game run in the background. This will prevent the device from going into doze mode, and it could increase battery life. So if you notice your Galaxy S7 or S7 Edge is getting less battery life after you've changed some of these options, you can come back in here and re-enable Doze for some of these applications.